Hi, everyone. My name is Wen, CEO of Trusting Social. We make financial inclusion history. The problem we address is that there are 3 billion invisible borrowers in emerging markets. For the last 100 years, banking industry can only serve top 10% of the population. The rest were stuck in a chicken egg problem because they don't have credit history, they cannot borrow money, and therefore cannot establish their credit history. And these are good customers because according to a research by the World Bank, two thirds of the middle class of the world will be in emerging markets in 2020. And right now they don't have access to formal credit. So our solution is very simple. We create three billion alternative credit scores from uh, different data sources like social networks, like telecom data, and not relying on the traditional and painful way of collecting um, credit history. This is the demand for consumer credit in emerging markets. Every year, there are about a third of the population borrow from some source. And yet, the formal banking sector just provides a fraction of that. And this gap is why we fill in, because we can leverage telecom data to evaluate credit risk, and telecom networks have very deep penetration in these markets. Right now, it's about 40 to 50 percent, and it's converging to 100 percent very quickly. So this is the opportunity that we can help, which increase the market size of consumer credit by four to five times. Okay, and why mobile data? Why is it even relevant? After analyzing all sorts of data, including social data, traditional uh, data that credit bureau provide, we find that this is one of the best sources. Because if we have the technology to analyze trillions of records, billions of connections in the society, we basically have a real time, holistic, and forward-looking view of credit worthiness. We can look at consumption habit, transaction history, social connections, mobility, employment, identity. So this is a case study that we did with Home Credit, which is the biggest lender in Vietnam. We take 12,000 uh, installment loans to fine tune our credit score, and then we validate on uh, 2,000 loans. This is one of the five uh, portfolios that, uh, that we work with uh, in home credit. And we find that our technology can help them to reduce 56% in credit loss, given that they already have the best uh, credit scoring model in Vietnam. And interestingly, our score is actually 40% more accurate than FICO, which is the best solution in the world. FICO was the one who invented um, credit scoring technology back in the 60s. So when we approach our telco, we would partner with uh, a couple of banks who provide um, loan performance data, which is just simply some phone numbers, and um, whether or not this customer default on a loan. Then we look back at um, the mobile usage history, and we build a credit scoring model, which basically a very complex model. From this model, we can score everybody. Then um, for each of these uh, mobile subscriber, we can generate a, a prediction of whether or not this borrower will default on a loan. Then banks validate this score based on the actual loan performance that they have. We care a lot about customer privacy, so we design a system where banks and telecom operators do not share data, and we get the data from both sources, but we don't know the identity of the customers. Whenever we send data to a bank, we will SMS customers who ask for their permission. We offer banks two things. First, we can help them to cut credit loss by 50%, and we charge a fee for credit scoring. And second, we can help them to double their customer base. We can do that because we can pre-score millions of customers um, of the telco operators. We can actively target them through SMS through our, and, and other channels. We can also have a push model where customers just SMS um, to ask for a loan, and then we score this customer in real time and return um, a credit score from which bank can make the decision instantly. We started with, with Vietnam, where we partnered with the biggest telecom operator there with 50 million customers. Our first customer is the biggest consumer financing company in Vietnam and one of the biggest in the world. We have a 
a very experienced team. Uh, my CTO is a PhD in computer science, worked for Stanford Research Institute on a number of DARPA projects. Uh, CFO is um, uh, used to let um, uh, Goldman Sachs security team in India. This is what we call the Moore's Law of Credit Scoring. FICO, which is the pioneer in credit scoring, takes about 60 years to cover 200 million customers in the US. The process is costly and it is linear. With the power of the big data, we want to do that in three or four years. So in a month, we will have the first 50 million customers to be scored so that they, they can borrow money from banks. And that's just the beginning. We'll go to different markets, and, um, and hopefully we'll reach one billion in a short period of time. Okay, so if you are a bank, partner with us to create financial products for billions of consumers worldwide. Thank you.